we put a very high emphasis on our imaging, um, both three-dimensional and four-dimensional imaging. We utilize that both at the time of treatment planning um, and our simulations, but we're the only centers in the area to actually utilize that while we're actually validating the position for treatment. So when patients come in for treatment, we can look not only at where that tumor is that day and account for any potential you know, millimeters and shifts that, that might occur because of slight errors in positioning and then adjust for that, but we'll also actually account for changes that might occur in breathing patterns. And so we use a hexapod and robotic couch, one of the few centers to do that, where we can actually adjust for six degrees of freedom, not only, you know, positional errors in terms of moving patients forward, back, up, down, and side to side, but also rotational errors, which is, is, is very rare, and allows us to, again, for deliver very precise treatments and then make very, very fine-tuned adjustments to conform our dose and, and make sure we're hitting exactly what we want to hit on a day-to-day -day basis. We are lucky in the sense that we have excellent staff, not only in terms of our physicians and the level of expertise that they have, but also our physicists, our dosimetrists, our therapists. They've trained at some of the best centers in the country and even some of the best centers in the world. And we've trained on a variety of different treatment platforms and methods of doing SBRT so that we can pick and choose so that, you know, for each patient, we can basically say, well, we think this method's going to work a little bit better or this method of breath hold's going to work a little bit better and basically adjust for that. And that reason for that is that we can actually tailor our treatments so that it's the same treatment that, you know, I would want to get if I was getting treated, um, which is what we think patients should actually get. They should get the same level of care that we would want ourselves. All this together allows us to optimize the experience for each individual patient, not just in terms of what's going to be the best method, the best technology, the best you know, modality for curates, but also for their individualized experience, which is another big part of this process.